everybody. Welcome to Coffee with Coach, brought to you by Duncan. I'm Lauren Screeden alongside Coach Nagy. Coach, nice win last weekend. How was Thanksgiving and then the long weekend after? Hi, Lauren. Yeah, it was great. I appreciate it. I thought our players really uh, did a great job of executing and in the end coming out with the win. Back at it, and it is My Cause, My Cleats this week, which you always participate in. So which organization are you supporting this year? Yeah, there's an organization called Guitars Over Guns, and uh, you know they're, they're, they're based out of Chicago and Miami, and I just think it's a pretty cool deal. I, uh, first of all, I'm, I'm, I'm into music. I've never played a guitar in my life, but someday in my life, I will learn how to play guitar, and I think it's neat, and I'm, I'm proud to be able to, to, to help out and be a part of that. So what does the design look like this year? I'm sure it looks pretty cool. Yeah, I like them. I think they're pretty cool. Uh, they're, they're gold and they have a, uh, a black design of a guitar on the front toe. And so I think they did a great job of putting it together and I, I like the colors. Well, we're going back to who tweeted it this week. So which one of your players watched the movie over the weekend about Venus and Serena Williams and said, King Richard needs a part two for Serena. Great movie. I'm going to go with A-Rob. What? Do you have Twitter secretly now? Am I right? You are right. How did you know that? No one actually told me that uh, that question was coming, but I will say I just something hit me. A-Rob is, uh, he is a sports fanatic. He knows everything about all sports, and so it doesn't shock me. So I took a little bit of a guess, and I was right. It's officially December and officially holiday season. So is the Christmas tree up yet? It is. You know, uh, my family did a great job. My wife and, and other parts of the family uh, decided to put the tree up uh, after the day after Thanksgiving. And so I think it's a really cool time. Real tree or fake tree? Um, ours is a fake tree. And we've had too many times where the Pine needles got all over the floor and the water spilled onto the floor and ruined the hard way. It just, it got kind of ugly. So now we just go fake and, and I'm okay with that. I never understood that. As a kid, I was always disappointed when we did a fake tree. And then last year, I did a real tree at my house, first time. I'm still picking up pine needles. We yeah. went out this weekend, bought a fake tree, pre-lit. I'm sorry, Merry Christmas. No, it's I hear just... you. It can, it can get pretty crazy, but I'm with you. That's why we go fake. Well, thanks for joining me, Coach. We'll see you next week on Copy with Coach. See you, Lauren. Thank you.